Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jarelle Mata. Today we're going to be doing the empties video. I am going to show you all the trash that I've been collecting for such a long time. I actually have a specific place in my closet, like really, really in the corner. And I do have this uh, Sephora bag that I collect all of my trash so I can do this type of video. So I think that I have been collecting enough trash. So now it's time for me to actually show it to you, tell you exactly what I liked and what I didn't. And yes. Let's get on it. But before we do, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And yeah, without further ado, let's get on to the video. So the first product that I have here is a shampoo and this is by the brand Matrix Biolash. This is the normalizing clean reset shampoo. And I love this thing. I end up buying the jumbo size from Ulta. And that is what is currently living in my bathroom. This is something that I will continue on repurchasing. I just love the scent of it. I love the way that it actually makes my hair feel and yeah i love it another product that is definitely going to be something that i will repurchase is this one right here this is the urban decay all-nighter setting spray the reason why mine is in the different packaging is because they did have a sale i think it was like last year sephora had a sale where you get two for the price of one and i end up picking on two bottles so yes i'm still actually working on the second bottle and they last you for a long time i do have other setting sprays maybe that's why it lasts me a little bit longer but yeah i love this thing i will never not get it this is something that is a must in my makeup collection so the next product that i will always always repurchase is this 100 percent acetone nail polish remover i got mine at publix and this is something that i use all the time so i do actually color my own nails pretty often that is something that i love doing so whenever i do get a petty and a mani it's just regular uh like petty and mani there's no like i don't like gels i don't like acrylics or anything like that i so i do have a pretty size collection of nail polishes just because i really do enjoy changing the nail polish at least once or twice a week so that is the reason why i will continue forever repurchase this so the next product that i have here is by Purology, and this is the hydrate sheer a conditioner and i love the way this one actually make my scalp feel very minty like minty fresh like i'm actually brushing my scalp um, however, these is so expensive, so expensive. And I don't think that it make like a huge impact in my hair or the growth of my hair or the texture of my hair for me to continue on purchasing. So that is the reason why I don't think that I will repurchase just because it is very pricey and I don't think that it just made a huge difference in my hair. So the next product that I have here, and you see it all the time in my empties videos, if you have seen any of them, um, is this one by Cinema Secret. This is a makeup brush cleaner. And I know that there are so many of them in the market and you can actually find like really, really great ones. But this one is the one that I constantly repurchase that I will continue on repurchasing. It just makes my brushes smell really, really good. It gets all the, it disinfects them and it gets all the yuckiness out of my brushes until I actually deep wash them. So yeah, that is the reason why I will continue on repurchasing this one. So the next product that I have here is by L'Occitane and I do like the soap. I actually enjoy the scent of it very, very much. It was like super nice and just very subtle it's not too perfumey um and it did really really nice with my skin however i'm using something else i don't think that i'm going to be repurchasing this one for a little while um but it is a great product so the next product that i have here is by neutrogena and this is the oil free eye makeup remover i love this thing i actually dropped like half of it and i was so upset but i dropped half of it and still lasted for a very long time but i need to repurchase it just because it is a great one it does such an amazing job on removing all of your eye makeup and it's very gentle yes it does not like sting my eyes and it doesn't burn or anything like that so yeah i really do like it so the next product that I have here is by Paul Mitchell and this is the Soothing Super Skinny Daily Shampoo. I am definitely not going to be repurchasing this one. The reason why I end up buying this one is because at one point in my life I was actually washing my hair every single day. Um, because especially during summertime here in Florida it gets so hot and so humid and my hair was actually getting so oily. I kind of actually changed it around and I decided that I was not going to be washing my hair every single day because I didn't think it was healthy 
nothing um i don't think it was actually doing anything any good for my hair like washing it every single day um so i end up just changing my whole routine and actually letting my oils just stay in my hair because it is good for your hair at the end of the day it's the oils that you are producing so because i wash my hair every three to four days this is definitely not doing it for me i don't feel like it leaves it clean i still feel like it's dirty and sometimes i actually have to wash it like three to four times with this one just so i can see a result and it's just not worth it so the next product that i have here is by tresemme and this is a thermal creation heat tamer leave-in spray and i didn't like it i had it for such a long time i'm so happy that i actually end up using it i don't feel like it was actually doing anything i didn't like the scent of it i didn't like the way it, my hair felt it felt like dirty afterwards so i'm glad that i was actually able to work with it i think that it lasts me this long because i was actually using just very little of it not too much of it and at one point i know that this was like everybody's favorite and i tried it and i hated it i really didn't like it i don't like the scent like i said it just doesn't it doesn't do it for me and it, there's still some in here but i'm just gonna say goodbye to it the next product that i have here is this one this is a lotion by hawaiian tropic this is the sheer touch after sun moisturizer this thing as you can see i still have some more i can't finish it i cannot i cannot put this in my body anymore it smells really really good it smells like pineapples i give it that yeah it smells really really good but like 30 minutes after applying this i like I can see there's like a layer on my skin and I, and I scratch it and I'm like so ashy. And I can't deal with ashy skin. Like I can. That is the reason why I actually put moisturizer on my skin. So I won't be ashy. Not to like be ashy. So yes, definitely not for me. It did not work out for me. Now if any of these products work out for you, great. You continue on using it. But these products definitely, some of them did not work out for me. So this is one of them and I will just not continue on using this one. I have to let it go. It's so sad because there's still like, you know, a third of the bottle in here, but I can't. The next product that I have here is, oh, I missed this so much. The next product that I have here is by Arbonne and this is the Night Repair Cream. I forgot that I have not repurchased this. My sister sells them. Um, she gets, I don't know how much commission off of it. I never asked. I don't care. These creams have actually worked wonders for my skin for so many years. And I actually stopped using them for quite some time already because I'm trying so many other products. But I do love these creams right here by Arbonne. I get zero commission. My sister doesn't give me anything. <laughs> but... I used it for so many years that I just, I can't say anything bad about this product because it actually works really, really, really good with my skin. So I, now that I see it, I might actually ask my sister to get me another bottle because I think these are so good. So the next product that I have here is by John Gellifin and this is the TLC Night Serum. I love this thing. So I already repurchased this one and I love it and it works with my skin very nicely. So yes. So the next product that I have here is by Josie Moran. This is the Whipped Argan Oil Face Butter and i really do like this one i'm not going to be repurchasing for now because i do have other moisturizers that i'm working on right now so i'm not going to be repurchasing but once those are done i will go back to this one as well as the arbonne because those are really really great ones so the next part that i have here is by sephora and this is the solid brush cleanser this is so good this is really 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 good however i just don't like the size of it i think it's too small uh, for what I do I need something that is big and that's why I keep on repurchasing the beauty blender one but if Sephora comes with like the big soap like the beauty blender has I will totally buy it because this was so good and I actually I like the scent on this one much better than the other one so next I have this jelly cleanser by drunk elephant I really didn't care for this at all I, I didn't think the cleanser was like all of that you know wow uh for the price i did get this in a set 
um, but the packaging is actually the one that did it for me because you have to twist it and squeeze the product but when you twist it back to close it there's still product here so you either wasting the product or like placing your the cleanser down and it, it creates a big yucky mess and I just I, I didn't really care for the packaging so I don't think that I'm going to be re I know for sure I'm not going to be purchasing this one at all um, just for a cleanser the price the packaging just not for me so the next product that I have here is by Peter Roth and this is the cucumber gel mask extreme detoxifying hydrator so this was really really good um, especially when I felt like my skin was like dry it just needed a little bit like a pick me up um, I will put this on and just felt really cooling and very soothing to my skin so I will be repurchasing this one just not for now because I do have other masks um, but I will be repurchasing this one for sure. The next product that I have is by Dr. Brand, and this is a sample that I got. This is the Pores No More uh, Pore Refiner, and this was really, really good, but it, it reminds me a lot of the Professional. It has like the same kind of color and texture to it, so it's nothing like super special, um, but it was a good one. So if you are looking for a primer and you wanna try something to actually pore minimizer, primer this is actually a good one the next product that i have here is by covergirl this is a mascara this is the so lashy pro blast i hated this mascara so much i poked my eyes so many times with this mascara i will definitely not be repurchasing i don't like the want i do not like um, what it did to my lashes. It didn't really do much to my lashes. It didn't keep the curl or anything like that. So I will definitely be passing on the CoverGirl mascara. So I have two of the Anastasia's um, Brow Wiz Brow Pencil in the shade a Dark Brown. These are a must in my collection. I will for always repurchase them. I love them. These are amazing brow pencils. The next product that I have here is by Benefit and it's also a brow pencil. This is my current favorite. I love, love so much. That is what I have on my brows today. Um, however, this one is in the shade four and the one that I have on my brows that I've been loving is six that is the one that i've been loving i just love the way that it blends the way that it stays in my brows i just i just been reaching for this one more the the anastasia one the anastasia i love but this one is my current favorite right now another product that i have here is a mascara and this is the remo this is something that i need to repurchase for sure because it is amazing for my lower lashes it does not smudge it does not like flake off or anything like that and i really really like this one. It's just the one is so tiny it's like perfect for your lower lashes so yes i will continue on repurchasing this one but i had this one for more than six months so i needed to like let it go another product for my brows is this one by anastasia and, and this is the shade right here that i actually used up and i could not believe i actually had to let it go just because i do not reach for the shade at all this is very very light and just not does not work out for me i do have two powders right now in my collections that i'm working on and i love so the next product that i have here that i have to let go just because the texture it just doesn't feel right and the scent is the one that really turned me off is the MAC lip gloss in the shade please me I need to repurchase this one it's a really really nice beautiful shade however it just feels weird on the skin like it is right now and the scent of it it's just expired it's expired you know I wish my makeup would last forever but it doesn't things do expire um so Oh yeah, and the scent, it's horrible. So the next product that I have here is by Tatcha. I actually have the full size of this one and I love it. I cannot recommend it enough. I think that is perfect, especially if you are like combination, oil to combination and during those hot, hot days and you wear makeup, this is the perfect face cream for you. So the last product that I have here is by Glam Glow. This is the Thirsty Mud Hydrating Treatment. I love this. I don't have a backup of this one, so I will be repurchasing just because I do love the way in my skin feels whenever I do wear this mask, especially for those days that my skin needs like a uh, hydration. Oh, this is so beautiful. Just thinking about it and how relaxing you feel when you have a mask on and you cannot really like do much so you just have like friends playing on the background or something and you're just relaxing relaxing 
and you're just relaxing masking chilling I love that. I will be repurchasing that one for sure. So yeah, that is it. If you stay until the end, you are amazing. Thank you, thank you very much. But yeah, that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I will see you next time. Bye.